local economies like Hamilton across the country. We have a very special story to showcase for you now. The first of a two-part report we're calling After the Burns. Dean Muse takes us into the world of the 43-year-old People's Choice winner at the Fashion Has No Boundaries Every Woman competition in Calgary. Kelly Filardo is an overcomer with a beauty and a passion that's more than skin deep. When she was just two years old, a garbage fire on a family acreage changed her life journey forever. Well, I don't remember any of the pain because I was so little, but I remember my surgeries from anywhere from about five and up. And because uh, once I was five years old, then I start remembering that. But I mean, I had surgeries um, when I got burnt. I had surgeries right up for, well, three months. Every two days I was in the operating room. And then I had surgery every, for sure, every two years, up until I was about 18. Third degree burns to over 75% of her body, hearing loss of 65% in one ear, and a patch of hair that still refuses to grow back have been some of the reasons she spent years struggling with her beauty. It's been kind of interesting, you know, growing up being, you know, with guys and, you know, and I was always oh, taught too so that strawberry. in order for me to be beautiful, I had to cover up my scars. <laughs> Um, a friend of mine, we hung out like every day, and one day we got in a fight, I don't remember what, but it's probably something really silly, and then, so she called my mom ugly, and and so her mom made her write a big apology note to me, but I really don't like when people judge my mom, so. As I was growing up, I never had boyfriends. Um, you know, I always wanted them, but never had them because, of course, I wasn't the cool girl. And, uh, you know, and, and so that made it tough for me because all my friends were having boyfriends, and, and I didn't. The camera has a husband that loves her, kids that laugh, play, and learn with mom and dad, and a renewed passion for life are among her favorite things that inspire her. Moving outside of her comfort zone and onto the fashion runway was a secret dream come true and a great part of her journey. Anybody who truly, really knows me knows that this is definitely not something I would ever do. And um, I did it for a couple reasons, but one reason was I had to prove that I could do it. They're looking for someone who is an everyday woman. And it was weird, because I just, I just knew I was going to get the top ten. I don't know why, but um, then competed again for the, the finals. And then I got the People's Choice Award. You know, at first I was a little disappointed I didn't win the whole thing. But then I was actually very excited that I didn't win because <laughs> because uh, I really realized throughout the process that I really am not a model. Kelly is quite a role model, though, and part two of that report tomorrow.